hybrid amplifier but using vacuum tube preamp stage. It uh, gives you that nice warm sound, great sound quality, great performance. It also utilizes a digital amplifier uh, so that we can get maintain maximum output with a fairly small unit that doesn't drag a lot of uh, current from your wall outlet and is fairly energy efficient. Our front speakers are actually two sets of speakers in one. We have from here down is your front speakers. The top one, it is a bi-amplified system. There are two sets of speaker wires running each tower. Uh, the top one is has an angle adjustment on it and it gives you a height adjustment. So the 7.1 is actually height, uh, front, center, and rear. Uh, and obviously the subwoofer, we're using a passive radiator on there to uh, give us a little bit more bottom end out of it. One of the things that um, you probably haven't seen too many HTIBs with any sort of attenuation controls or anything, but in actual fact, we offer uh, a full seven band equalizer. Now, we all know what kind of quality and performance you can expect to get out of speakers like this, and the whole idea and the way you're gonna get any performance out of a speaker like this is manipulation. Most home theater, in fact, in 2011, I don't think you saw a home theater package that offers any sort of even a bass and treble control. We have a full five band equalizer, maybe it's a seven band equalizer, it is. Um, built into pretty much all our home theater packages, and this year we've made it easier to, to, attempt, to go into it. You don't have to go into the menu settings. You can go in through the tools and be able to use it from there. The uh, other thing that we've offered is because the uh, base is often considerably different from one program to another, we have a hotkey on the remote control. Simple, easy, press, and now you have your subwoofer level control on it. So great added benefit that you don't have to go into your menu functions, you don't have to do anything, and it'll automatically allow you to bring the base and treble over down. So now you don't have to read your owner's manual for 20 minutes. How do you turn the subwoofer over? Nobody, yeah. nobody reads the owner's manual anyway. Nobody <laughs> wants to. So um, this scene here, uh, first little part is gonna be of the story of, what, of uh, Dominic and he's getting out of jail. And then the next scene we're gonna see, uh, imagine yourself driving down that highway and you got the guy on your right shoulder and he's just dying to get by you. And we'll go from there. That's me. Good job. Crank it. My wife's not here. We can crank it. <laughs> <laughs> She's met my wife. Somewhere right now, she's going, is he listening to loud music? Dominic Toretta, you are hereby sentenced to serve 25 years to life at the Lompoc Maximum Security Prison System without the possibility of early parole. What's the retail on uh, that Thanks for asking. $999 gets your top of the line piece. The um, couple of added benefits with this thing as well, it does come in the box with our SWA 5000, which is the rear speaker uh, wireless adapter. So that's good for a couple hundred dollars right there. So these speakers right here, there's no wires running to the front of the room, right? So it's clean to set up and it's easy to set up. 
hardwood floors. A lot of people hardwood nowadays. Uh, be able being able to run speakers from one end of the room to the other. Not that uh, not that likely. And in some cases, the wife usually goes, "No, I'm not letting you run wires underneath the baseboards. I don't care how well you think you're going to be able to hide them. It ain't happening." <laughs> As the drill bit comes up. <laughs> 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 Oops. I got a router. <laughs> Um, as far, stuff like that, things like the equalizer built into it, you hear that, I mean, like the sound sounds quite good. Yeah. And it's not a lot of money, and it's definitely going to appeal to that, to that customer that wants that one brand solution. If I'm buying a Samsung TV, shouldn't I be buying a Samsung home theater package? Yes. We have, you know, absolutely. <laughs> Dave agrees with me, too. Good time. So, yeah, we have easy to use products. Simple. Uh, it also features all the apps built into it with our smart features built into it, just like the TVs. Not as many apps on the home theater packages, but still you get lots of uh, choices and lots of stuff to use on there. Thanks. Dave just needs some POs now. Good job. <laughs> Can you roll your own tubes in? No. The center inside there, so it's one of the benefits of you know, going to the solution. Have we demo? Do we demo that? Sorry, I'll share. No, um, your stolen movies and how, <laughs> and how we can. I didn't say.